all of the hemp! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> you guys are gonna do this all by hand? <laughs> That's the plan right now. That's why we need volunteers. That's why we love you guys for volunteering. Because if you don't volunteer, it's Luke and Megan and I, and we will be crying the whole time. And the hemp will not be as joyful as if we picked it in the spirit of community and big dreams and people coming in to help. There's something for everyone. There's something for everyone, exactly. Great. First of all, thank you so much. Thank you so much. I love that you're helping. It makes me so happy. When you come out to help, you if you're coming on a Friday, Saturday, Sunday, that is a Harvest Symphony, your food. And Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Yeah. And breakfast, lunch, and dinner are included. And you're welcome to take a bag, like a shopping bag of hemp buds home. And you're welcome to take as many roots as you can personally pull. Uh, we have no plans right now, unfortunately, to harvest the roots. It's just way beyond the scope of our, our labor pool right now. And so if people want to use that for their own personal medicine, they're totally welcome to take those home. And welcome to New Paradigm Hempery. This is your tour. Alex and I are going to give you the tour and we'll tell you all about the hempery. We'll tell you some history of the hempery. We'll tell you what to expect when you get here to help with volunteering. When you get here, this is the Quonset. That's home base. Wherever the cars are, park towards the main road of those cars. You're awesome. We'll see you soon. So the house is its whole own thing. It's a private residence and although the people there participate in New Paradigm Farms, the building does not belong to us. Um, and so New Paradigm Hempery is right here and this is your home base and your touch point for everything that you could possibly need. So New Paradigm Hempery started as a dream. It started at a potluck. A bunch of people meeting last October and talking about hemp and how excited we were about the potentials for um, health, for medicine, for restoring the environment, for our own personal use, and also for creating collaborative uh, economics within the community. And we went out to Regina, Saskatchewan to check out a hemp farm, um, Hemp Haven. Travis runs it from there. And we got, we were so inspired that when we came back, we were like, we got to look for some land and we got to get some, some, we had our first batch of seeds from, from the farm there. And we, we knew we wanted to plant them, so we went looking for land, and, and this is the land that we found. It's uh, near Cremona, Alberta, so it's about an hour and 10 minutes uh, north of Calgary, and it's uh, 167 acres, so a quarter section. And we had originally rented just this top part with plans to cultivate these sort of easy field sections. The in-betweens are all forests and marshes and ponds, and it's really beautiful, um, really beautiful land to be on. Um, and then we ended up actually joint venturing with our farmer who, who's doing this land and the land below. Um, his name's Earl, he's awesome, you'll meet him. And, uh, and so we're actually cultivating almost 60 acres. We were aiming to cultivate about five acres, which is the size of Pan. And we ended up with 60, which is why we're asking for help and why we're calling for volunteers and why we're so glad that you guys are coming out. The bathroom got a huge upgrade, like massive. Um, so when you get into the Quonset, you're gonna go to the welcome station. It's directly to your right and you can drop your stuff on that white bench and um, hang up your jackets, whatever it may be. And your next step is to find out where we're at, where the team is at. We might be in the field, we might be right there. If we're in the field, you can use the walkie-talkie to get a hold of us. And if it's your first time, make sure that you sign a waiver. We require that you guys sign the waiver when you arrive, if it's your first time, um, just to cover our butts in case anybody chops off a toe while they're chainsawing. Um, it is a farm, it is, you know, there are dangerous things that happen and because we're running on volunteer labor, we're not covered by the normal farming um, governmental things and so we just want to cover our butts and we appreciate you being a part of that and it also helps us stay in contact and there's some information about you know our general practices and also feel free to take a map um, so that you can figure out where you're at and feel free to take a walking tour on any of those uh, pathways that are down on the farm it's really beautiful land and we want you to enjoy it while you're here Past the green line Why don't you cross the green line, guys? Because there's dangerous stuff! Like what? Like a saw! Yikes! Now Safety say first! Oh, uh, uh, hello, I have a store. I have a store. Wanna see my store? 
The store is volunteer run, and so you can contact Luke, Megan, myself, or one of the other producers to deliver or um, get ch change for your purchases. You are able to see we have price lists for all of our different vendors, and it is a community-based store, so every product there is from somebody who's been to the Hempery or helped at the Hempery or is directly created from uh, a Hempery product. So that's super exciting, and... Uh, we encourage you to support our endeavors by purchasing things from the yummy, store. Yummy, booty, goody. <laughs> thank you, thank you. <laughs> Kombucha. 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 Mountain Mystics, watch for new labels coming soon. Look at these. They smell wonderful. If you're coming out to help, make sure that you bring boots, make sure that you bring gloves, make sure that you bring warm stuff and cold stuff. Um, the weather can be inclement, it can be good, it can be bad, and we keep working so, regardless of what the weather is ready. like. Yeah, we're going to do round two, out in the rain. When you're coming out, make sure that you bring the things you need to take care of your body. Whatever you would normally do at home, make sure you have those things. Also, if you've got allergies, bring allergy medication. Uh, we do have hemp oil available for sale and for use at the Quonset. And just ask me about getting some of that if you need it. It really helps with itches, cuts, scratches, and bruises. But no matter what the weather's like during the day, we always make time to be around the fire, to share time together to sing together and celebrate how much we've worked together and how connected we are at the end of the day. <laughs> Gemini Field 1, we've completed! Yes, Good work, guys. Everybody, stook, stook your hamsters, yeah. Everybody, stook your hamsters, right? Harvest time. All right. Ta -da. Thank you so much for being a part of the New Paradigm Hempery, New Paradigm Farms. We love you guys so much.